Welcome to Learn Yourself. Today we are going to understand the Sol numerical that is example 8.3 from the chapter number 8 motion. This chapter is under CBSE standard 9 syllabus. So it says that Usha swims in a 90 meter long pool. She covers 180 meter in one minute by swimming from one end to other end and back along the same straight path. Find the average speed and average velocity. So here this is a pool and here this is at one side it is 90 meter long. It is 90 meter long. So she goes from initial position to here at the end and again she comes back here. So total 90 plus 90 she covers 180 meter and that much she swims. So that is how her journey starts and ends. So starting point and ending point is the same but she covers 180 meter distance. We have to find out average speed and we have to find out average velocity. So let us first find out what is average speed. So it is average speed equals to what is the equation of average speed? The total distance divided by total time. So here total distance divided by total time taken for this distance. So here total distance is 90 plus 90 that is 180 meter. So it is 180 meter total distance and total time taken. Now here she covers 180 meter. So here total distance time is 1 minute. They have not given for the one journey. They have given for the complete journey. That once she starts and comes back, she did this in one minute. So here we are writing one minute. But now here meter is always go along with second. So we have to convert this minute into second. So how we are converting minute into second? One minute equals to 60 second. So instead of minute, we have to write here second. So here it is 60 second. So 180 divided by 60 second. So here we will get answer 0, 0 will go. Here 3, 2 is 6 and 9, 2 is 18. So we got here 9 by 3. Again we will get 3 meter per second will be her average speed. Now let us find out the average velocity. Now average velocity equals to displacement divided by time taken. So what is displacement here? Even though she has covered 180 meter her final point and initial point is the same because from where she has started she came back to that point again. So here displacement is zero. Even though she has covered this much distance her displacement is zero. So here we are writing zero divided by 60. So in turn this quantity will be zero that is average velocity. So when we are writing the final answer that average speed. So what is the average speed? Average speed is 3 meter per second and average velocity is 0 meter per second because her displacement is 0. Average velocity is displacement by time and her displacement is 0 because from where she has started she came back to its original point. So hope this video has solved your doubt. In coming videos we are going to learn many more important concepts. So don't forget to subscribe learn yourself. I'll see you in next video. Till then keep learning, keep sharing.